Okay, for this video I'm going to review using a dividing head, then quickly go over some definitions and formulas. I will talk about the borer hole and keyway. I will rough cut the blank. I will round off the brass to the 20 millimeter outer diameter. Then I will cut the teeth. Okay, as I stated in my previous video, it takes me 40 turns of this handle around this dividing plate to turn the chuck once. Now since 40 is not divisible by 18, I will need to use a division plate to get the 18 teeth I need. Basically it takes 40 rotations around the division plate to make one chuck rotation and one division plate has 18 index holes. That means you need 720 index holes to make one chuck rotation, or 18 teeth. Dividing both sides by 18 gives you 40 index holes per tooth. That comes out to two division plate rotations plus four holes to make one tooth. Now for the definition and formulas, I will be cutting a single module 18 tooth gear. Using the formula, I get a 20 millimeter outside diameter, and the depth of cut will be 2.157 millimeters. To make this gear, I started by drilling an 8 millimeter hole in the middle of some brass scraps. I then used an end mill bit to cut the keyway and finished it off with a file. Next I cut a keyway into an 8mm bolt and used it to mount the brass scraps in the chuck. Now that I have a blank, I'm going to do a rough cut to get it into the general shape that I'm looking for. Doing this allows me to make lighter more accurate cuts for the 20 millimeter diameter. For the next step, I will be using 36 cuts to form the 20 millimeter outer diameter. And finally, I will cut the 18 teeth with the involute cutter. 